the system of nature or the laws of the moral and physical world système de la nature au de la du monde physique et du monde moral is a work of philosophy by Paul Henri Thierry Baron Dolbach 1723 to 1789 it was originally published under the name of Jean-Baptiste de Mirabeau, a deceased member of the French Academy of Science. Dolbach wrote and published this book, possibly with the assistance of Diderot but with the support of Jacques-André Nijin, anonymously in 1770, describing the universe in terms of the principles of philosophical materialism, the mind is identified with brain, there is no soul. Without a living body, the world is governed by strict deterministic laws, free will is an illusion, there are no final causes, and whatever happens takes place because it inexorably must. Most notoriously, the work explicitly denies the existence of God, arguing that belief in a higher being is the product of fear, lack of understanding, and anthropomorphism. Though not a scientist himself, Dolbach was scientifically literate and he tried to develop his philosophy in accordance with the known facts of nature and the scientific knowledge of the day, citing, for example, the experiments of John Needham as proof that life could develop autonomously without the intervention of a deity. It makes a critical distinction between mythology as a more or less benign way of bringing law-ordered thought on society, nature and their powers to the masses and theology. Theology which, when it separates from mythology raises the power of nature above nature itself and thus alienates the two i.e. nature all that actually exists, from its power, now personified in a being outside nature, is by contrast a pernicious force in human affairs without parallel. Its principles are summed up in a more popular form in Dolbach's Bon Sens, O Ides Naturels opposes Ox Ides Surnaturels. Criticism The book was considered extremely radical in its day and the list of people writing refutations of the work was long. The prominent Catholic theologian Nicolas Sylvestre Bergier wrote a refutation titled Examine du Materialisme. Materialism examined. Voltaire, too, seized his pen to refute the philosophy of the système in the article Dieu in his Dictionnaire philosophique, while Frederick the Great also drew up an answer to it. Commenting on the book, Frederick observed, when one speaks in public he should consider the delicacy of superstitious ears, he should not shock anybody, he should wait till the time is sufficiently enlightened to let him think out loud. It is speculated that Frederick was motivated to write a criticism of the system of nature because the book contained an attack not just on religion, but also on monarchy. Topic. Appreciation and influence Dolbach's friend Denis Diderot had enthusiastically endorsed the book, What I Like is a Philosophy Clear, Definite, and Frank, such as you have in the system of nature. The author is not an atheist on one page and a deist on another. His philosophy is all of one piece. P. B. Shelley became an ardent atheist after reading The System of Nature, and proceeded to translate the book into English. According to Will Durant, The System of Nature contains the most comprehensive description of materialism and atheism in the entire history of philosophy. In his student days, Goethe had recoiled with revulsion at the contents in the book. In his old age, he harbored similar views We belong to the laws of nature, even when we rebel against them. 
According to Voltaire, the book was very popular among the populace, including scholars, the ignorant, and women. <laughs>